welcome back to my channel and welcome to another makeup tutorial. So today's makeup is going to be a very intense, smoky, royal blue eye. I actually got this new palette. This is the Coastal Sense Smoky Eye Palettes. I did get this in my BoxyCharm box. When I opened this, I about had a heart attack. The colors in here are so beautiful. If you don't follow me on Snapchat, I will have my name down below. Make sure you are following me because occasionally I will do swatches on some palettes that I receive in the mail. I did have full-on swatches of all of these and honestly, I was so blown away by the pigmentation of this palette. So I decided that I wanted to play with this really pretty matte royal blue and this is the look that I came up with. So I really hope you guys enjoy this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you do. Share it and don't forget to subscribe to my channel to stay updated with all my videos. Thank you guys for watching. Again, enjoy the video and I'll talk to you guys soon. All right, so I've already applied my foundation. This is a Born, the Too Faced Born This Way foundation. I'm in the color Sand. And then I applied my bronzer. This is a MAC Mineralized Skin Finish in Deep Dark, I believe. Love, love this bronzer. And then for the highlight, I use the Makeup Forever Dual, Dual Highlights, whatever, but this gorgeous highlights on my cheeks. And then for contour, I use the Kat Von D Shade and Light Palettes, and I applied a little bit of Lyric and Loose, I believe. Or it could be levitation. I'm not sure. But I apply that just to brighten up my eyes. So moving on to the actual makeup, I'm applying the Smashbox 24 hour photo finish primer and I'm applying a little bit of my MAC Pro Longwear Concealer on the lids, just a tiny, tiny, tiny bit. It's going to go a long, long way. Then I'm gonna take Orange Soda by Anastasia Beverly Hills. I know that they sell these now individually. I haven't had the chance to order any of them, but these are really pretty eyeshadows. This is, uh, what's the name of the palette? It's lavish, and it's really old, but it's absolutely one of my favorite palettes that I own. So I'm going to apply that just as a transitional color before we go in with the darker colors. Now, because I am going with a smoky blue eye, I definitely want to apply a base that is going to really just pick up on those dark colors. So what I did is I just applied a little bit of my LA Girl. Um, this is almost like a primer and it's in the color black. And I kind of left the center of the lid open because I do want to apply a different color on here. You will see that in the next couple of clips. Going into the Coastal Sense Revealed Smoky Eye Palette, I'm going to grab a matte white eyeshadow. Use whatever you have, as long as it's matte and it has either a white color or a bone color. Again, this is just really going to open up our eyes because we are going to be using a dark color, which is that really pretty navy blue. So I'm going to pat that on, and then I'm going to go in with this gorgeous royal matte blue shadow and I'm starting on the outer corners I really like to start there because I like to really pack on the color and then just kind of distribute it as I go so then I just go back and blend everything to make sure that there are no harsh lines and yeah I just take your time when you're blending especially dark colors because it can get messy very very easy so I just make sure that I take my time and I apply the color and if I need to reapply it you know in case I have any harsh lines or any spots I just make sure that I go back and then I take a bigger brush this is by Beauty Junkies absolutely hands down the best brush ever I will have it linked down below I don't have a coupon code anymore I will try to get one for you guys but these brushes are amazing super good quality and really affordable so after that I'm just going to apply my NYC liquid eyeliner I actually went with a very thick dramatic line I really wasn't intending in doing that but you know you gotta go with the flow so I just you know went with whatever I was doing um, <clears throat> I would suggest if you are recreating this look to maybe do a thinner line because it kind of 
you know, that white part of the eye, it kind of disappeared, which kind of sucked. But at the end, it looked okay, so just, just go with it, girl. Just go with it. <laughs> And after that, I'm applying these gorgeous eyelashes that I got off of eBay. I, again, I will have them down below. And then I'm going to move on directly onto the lower lashes of my eyes. And I'm going to be applying my Marc Jacobs Black Eyeliner. Hands down again, the best eyeliner I've ever tried. It's so creamy and it's so black. And then I take a little bit of that navy blue eyeshadow and I just smoke it out on my lower lash line. Um, again, because we are doing something smoky, I like to be dramatic. Now I'm going to move on to the NYX Glitter um, Glue. It's really new and I really like it. And I'm going to be applying a little bit of glitter. This is some random glitter that I got off of eBay years ago. But I will try to find it for you guys. Just any like silver glitter I think will look really cute. And again, it's going to open up our eyes. Just so they don't look too small or too close. And then after that, I'm going to take this NYX Lingerie Liquid Lipstick. Um, I don't know the name again. It's not in front of me, but I will have it down below So after you've applied your lipstick, that is it. You are done with this look I hope you guys recreated if you do hashtag OMG lashes so I can see your recreations Thank you guys so much for watching Please subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Take care